Find the profit setting drive your secret. Let's look at building interiors using this type of research. There are eight steps one can follow to build theories using case study research. The first is getting started. At that stage, we must have a part, we must have priority constructs. They are neither driven by a theory nor related to hypothesis. The purpose of conducting theory building here is because there is no theory to support the phenomena. Second is to select cases to build the theory. At that stage, one must follow the ground of theory approach and use theoretical sampling or purposive sampling to maximize the relevant observations to build a theory. In that, we must attempt to increase the variation in cases so that the findings could support external validity. The third is data collection methods. We can use multiple methods of data collection, interviews, observation and documents. Fourth is entering the field for data collection. While collecting data, we must analyze the data so that the data inform us of the findings and data could drive further analysis. Which means we take the position and become flexible to investigate emerging issues. Fifth is data analysis. When conducting data analysis, we must analyze within the case and between cases. Within case analysis, we will provide familiarity with data for the preliminary theory generation. Between case analysis will help us to develop patterns through multiple meanings or multiple realities. Six is shaping hypothesis that is informed by the data analysis. This requires several iterations of tabulating the pattern making can be examined in relation to the literature as those literature that are supporting and those literature that are against the findings. Eight is the closure at this stage along with the literature that have informed us about the convergence and divergence we extend further data collection to ensure that there is sufficient and saturated information about the constructs that are developed from the case study research for theory building. And when we reach the stage where there's marginal improvements from data collection and analysis, that stage is called theoretical saturation. 
and at that point we close the research and present the constructs and their relationships.